were down 2-1 after doubles, but a very good team and good doubles. Uh, you know, they, I to give them credit, they, they played well. We've been down this year many, many times against good teams. We were down in the finals of the regional. Um, you know, we're down here today many times where we fought back and showed a lot of resilience and hard fight. And, you know, we got good singles players, but more importantly, we got girls that really believe that we can win and they're fighting hard. So that's a big, it's a big plus for us, um, you know, because, you know, we've, We've been relying on that, but you know, hopefully it doesn't come back to bite us one of these matches. You know, we just we're trying to get up. Um, that's our goal is to be up after doubles. And you know, if we don't achieve that goal, at least we know we've got a chance in singles with any team in the nation. So that, that really helps us, helps us with our confidence. And it's a hard way to go about getting wins, but we're, we seem to be scraping them out. And so that means these girls' hard work is paying off. Uh, you know, I've got a great assistant coach, Adam Drysdale. I give him all the credit for as far as working with the girls. Um, he's been the players are really committed to our goal this year, which is to do as you know as as well as we can. And if we can win the whole nationals, that's our goal. Um, but at the same time, we're you know willing to work the daily grind uh, to get it done. So I think that's what the girls have showed this this year because we haven't really let up in any matches this year. We haven't had any bad matches. Um, you know, to get 30 wins, you can't have any bad matches. So uh, I really you know give it. All the credit to the girls and Adam and their hard work. Uh. Hey. Hey.